significance of our canoes is the waterways is our travel routes to help trade with other nations and help feed other nations. And so these were our highways. The highways of yesterday are the rivers and streams that are still here today. Hickory Edwards, my nephew, was paddling and his idea, his vision was to open up all the waterways back to our people, how we used to travel. And then the two row wampum 400 year anniversary discussion came up and uh, the discussion about going to where we met the Dutch down at on the Hudson, what's called the Hudson today, but in our language it's called the river that flows both ways. And so the two rows of paddlers started off here at this spot, July 2nd of uh, 2013, and traveled down to Albany, to Coho's, Coho's Falls. And at Coho's Falls in Rensselaer, we had a group of allies that joined us. About 200 paddlers on the average day. And it was 13 days of paddling from Rensselaer, New York, down to Manhattan. Traveled in all the weathers, hot, sunny days, and windy, and choppy, and so forth. And there was approximately 370 miles of paddling on the water to get to Manhattan, Pier 96 in New York. And then another five or six miles of walking across Manhattan over to the United Nations to deliver our message, and also share some of the fresh, pristine water that we still have. It traveled from here. A lot of friendships that were made throughout the waters here and uh, there was a lot of struggles for some of the inexperienced paddlers and people stepped right up and helped and so we got to know each other and we, we met a lot of friends and so for the youngsters to acknowledge that or to participate in this it's a great experience for future generations they would clearly understand why we're out so hard and strong to protect the waters for future generations <laughs>